Right, today's video is about the Easy SMX keyboard. Now, it's a gaming keyboard. It's, it's, it's a keyboard. <laughs> now, it's a, it's got like a retro feel to it. I can see the red, blue, orange, and the green, and the orange. Well, the dark orange, green, and the orange and the purple. But it looks like it's got retro colours rather than the vivid, brighter, um, more modern day RGBs. But I do like the feel of it. These are blue mechanical switches and we've got decent actuation like uh, key presses. So I'm going to literally test this out on like a game uh, real quick just to see what it's like. Uh, but let's talk about it real quick. It's uh, not too heavy but it has got a full metal chassis. It's a full QWERTY keyboard and you've got Windows lock uh, button and obviously your numeric keys on the side there and then you've got your gaming uh, was there and was there for the up and down and left and right which is nice to see but sometimes when you're gaming you don't really look down at it but if you're an amateur which you might be if you're into this sort of stuff then let's go but I am thinking uh, this is a rather cheap keyboard until when I looked at the price price is 56 pound 54 pence uh, but on their website which is a terrible website you need to get someone to fix that website. It's $63.99 uh, and it says it's got six color LED light backlight. Now I can't really figure out how to change the lights but at the moment I can just see that if I hold down FN and home you've got breathing mode but I'm sure we'll have more than that. We've just got to. There we go. You can switch them off if you don't want them off and you can switch them back on if you want them on. So one, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, that might be just what it is. You get, you just get that. That is it. Um, on the top, you've got all your media keys and everything like that as well. So your home, your um, lock, your email, your play and pause and forward, skip and all that for obviously media controls, the volume rocker for up and down as well and internet buttons if you use it for that. And then obviously a Windows lock key there as well. And um, it's quite illuminated and it's not too like, it's all right in here, you know, it's not like too dark or anything. Anyway, metal chassis, brushed like metal. It looks pretty good. Um, it's got a rest pad on there that you have to obviously use two screws, two Phillips screws to um, obviously unscrew it out there and a plastic bottom. Um, and I think, yes, you do have rubber feet so you don't scratch your desk. And you've got some rubber feet there as well. So all we're gonna do is uh, test it out. But before we do that, do you wanna hear it clicking? We'll hear it clicking after the game. So that's what we'll do. <laughs> right, so let's try a game out and see what it's like. So let's let's do PUBG. Uh, 